Hi students, this is differential equations part 9, last part. You are solving some problems using linear differential equations. Find the general solution of given differential equations. General solution. Differential equations. Find the general solution of the differential equation. x into dy upon dx plus 2 times y is equal to x square into log x. Find the general solution of the differential equations x into dy upon dx plus 2 times y is equal to x square into log x. Here given differential equation is first type x into dy upon dx plus 2 times y is equal to x square into log x. First rewrite in the form of dy upon dx plus p into y equal to q. It means make dy upon dx coefficient is unity. Therefore, dividing each terms by x, you get dy upon dx plus 2 divided by x into y divided by x is equal to x into log x, x, x cancel, which is in the form of dy upon dx plus p into y is equal to q. Here you can say that the value of p is equal to 2 by x and the value of q is equal to x into log x. It's clear. Next steps you finding the integrating factors. You know that in this case e to the power integral of p into dx e to the power integral of what is the value of p here 2 into 1 by x into dx you know that its value is e to the power p into log x to the base e or you write e to the power log of x square to the base e using properties of logarithms m into log n means log of m to the power n logarithm. here base same is there therefore its value is equal to x square it is very very important steps integrating factors then write the general solutions directly what is the general solutions the general solution of the differential equation is y into integrating factor is x square is equal to integral of integrating factor into q what is q x into log x into dx plus integral constant next Simplify x into y square, uh, y into x square is equal to log x into x square into x means x cube into dx plus integral constant. Here you know that it is the product of two functions using integrations by parts. In integrations by parts, the logarithm function is first functions and algebraic function is the second functions. Therefore, write first functions log x integration of x cube means x raised to 4 divided by 4 minus integral of log x derivative is 1 by x integration of x cube already by the way x raised to 4 by 4 into dx plus integral constant c2 to get the second integral constant therefore this value is x to the power 4 into log x divided by 4 minus 1 by 4 into 1 x x cancel x cube into dx plus integral constant c2 therefore you can say that y into x square is equal to x raised to 4 into log x divided by 4 minus 1 by 4 into integration of x cube is x raised to 4 divided by 4 plus integral constant. Suppose you say that c3 and both of Suppose multiplying each terms by 16 madidre, 16 times y into x square is equal to x raised to 4, 4 times x raised to 4 into log x minus x to the power 4 plus integral constant c. This one is the general solution of the given differential equations. Very simple problems or put as it is. You can write plus c. It is the general solution of the given differential equations. One more problem. Find the general solutions of the given differential equation equations 1 plus x square into dy upon dx plus 2 times xy is equal to 1 divided by 1 plus x square the given differential equations the solution is 
Here the given differential equation is 1 plus x square into dy upon dx plus 2 times x into y is equal to 1 divided by 1 plus x square. Very simple problems. Right? First, rewrite in the form of dy upon dx plus p into y equal to q forms. Therefore, make a coefficient of dy upon dx is unity. Therefore, dividing each terms by 1 plus x square. 1 plus x square in the divide multiply, it implies you get dy upon dx plus 2x divided by 1 plus x square into y is equal to 1 divided by 1 plus x square, right? Which is in the form of dy upon dx plus p into y equal to q forms. Here you can say that p is equal to 2x divided by 1 plus x square and q is equal to 1 divided by 1 plus x square and you know that integrating factor next step therefore integrating factors e to the power integral of p into dx its value is e to the power integral of 2x divided by 1 plus x square into dx you know that e to the power integration of 2x divided by 1 plus x square here you know that 1 plus 1 divided by 1 plus x square is tan inverse x but 2x divided by 1 plus x square means it is the derivative of 1 plus x square is 2x f dash x divided by f of x into dx forms therefore its value is a log of denominators 1 plus x square to the base e therefore its value is 1 plus x square is the integrating factors. Then write the general solutions. Therefore, the general solution is this is the general solutions y into integrating factor is 1 plus x square is equal to integral of 1 plus x square into q. What is the value of q? 1 divided by 1 plus x square into dx plus integral constant c1. Very, very simple problems. That is y into 1 plus x square is equal to here these two cancels integration of 1 into dx plus integral constant. Therefore, y into 1 plus x square is equal to x plus integral constant. It is the general solution of the given differential equations. Very simple problems. The next example, find the general solution of the given differential equation x into dy upon dx plus y minus x into y is equal to 0. Find the general solution of the differential equations x into dy upon dx plus y minus x plus x into y into cot x equal to 0. First rewrite into general forms. Here the given differential equation is x into dy upon dx plus y plus x into y into cot x is equal to x. Just I rewrite. This minus x comes to right hand side plus x. These two terms. Here you know that x into dy upon dx in these two terms y is common terms take outside x into cot x into y is equal to x. Next dividing each terms by y. Now standard form tarbeko andre coefficient of dy upon dx unity agirbeko andre na ito 1 plus 1 by x plus cot x. Now direct tag bariyadidre is equal to 1 which is in the form of dy upon dx plus p into y is equal to q. What is p? Here the p is 1 by x plus cot x o and q is equal to 1. Then find the integrating factors. What is integrating factors? e to the power integral of p into dx. e to the power integral of what is the value of p? 1 by x plus cot x into dx. You know that its value is e to the power 1 by x means log x plus cot x means log of sin x. Here again using the properties of logarithms. Log m plus log n is equal to log of m into n x into sin x to the base e. Therefore, x into sin x is the integrating factors. It is clear. Therefore, write the general solutions. What is the general solution of this differential equations? y into x into sin x is equal to integration of x into sin x into 1. Q is 1. 1 into x into sin x means x into sin x into dx plus integral constant. 
Here you know that in right hand side x into sin x, the product of two functions. Here the first function is algebraic trigonometric function is the second function. Therefore, here simplify this value is equal to y into x into sin x is equal to first function x. What is integral? Uh, sorry, the first I late. Here the first function is algebraic functions. The second function is trigonometric functions. The first function x. Integration of sin x. Here you know that minus cos x minus integral of derivative of x means 1. No? Integration of sin x is minus cos x into dx plus integral constant c2. Therefore, x into y into sin x is equal to minus x into cos x minus minus plus integration of cos x into dx plus integral constant c2. Therefore, x into y into sin x equal to minus x into cos x plus the integration of cos x is sin x plus integral constant. This one is the general solution of the given differential equations or divided by x into sin x marbodo. You can write like this forms or put as it is. This one is the general solution of the given differential equations. And one more. Find the general solution of the given differential equation. Next one is find the general solution of the differential equations x into dy plus y minus x square into dx equal to 0. First here rewrite into standard form. Next find the integrating factors and then the get the general solution of the given differential equations. Here first write the given differential equation is the solutions. The given differential equation is x into dy plus y minus x square into dx equal to 0. Rewrite this value is x into dy is equal to minus y minus x square into dx or write x square minus y into dx interchanging minus y plus x square or write x into dy upon dx is equal to x square minus y. It is right. It implies you can write dy upon dx is equal to x minus y divided by x or rewrite this function first write in the standard forms dy upon dx dy upon dx minus minus comes to here plus 1 by x into y is equal to x. Just rewrite x into dy plus y minus x square equal to dx. Here rewrite this values you get the values x into dy is equal to x square minus y into dx divided by dx x square minus y divided by x x square by x is x minus y by x. This minus y by x is comes to left hand side, which is in the form of standard forms dy upon dx plus p into y is equal to q forms. Here p is equal to 1 by x and q is equal to x. Therefore, integrating factor is e to the power integral of p into dx, e to the power integral of what is the value of p? 1 by x into dx. You know that integration of 1 by x with respect to x is log x to the base e, e to the power log x to the base e, bases are same, its value is x. Then write the general solutions. What is the general solution of the given differential equations? y into integrating factor is equal to integrating factor into q. What is the value of q? q means again x into dx plus integral constant. It means x into y is equal to integration of x square into dx plus integral constant. x into y is equal to integration of x square means x cube by 3 plus integral constant. This one is the general solution of the given differential equations or simplify. 3 times y, even a c2 on the head, 3 times x into y is equal to x cube plus c on the head. Or up to this step is sufficient. It is clear. And one more, the last questions. Usually, you put in the form of dy upon dx plus p into y is equal to q. Or write in the form of dx upon dy is also. I solving one problems using dx upon dy plus p into x equal to q minus x plus 2 times y square into dy is equal to 0. 
Next example, find the general solution of the differential equations y into dx minus x plus 2 times y square into dy is equal to 0. Here also, suppose here write y into dx is equal to x plus 2 times y square into dy, right? Suppose divided by dx, suppose here you write y into uh, dy upon dx into x plus 2 times y square is equal to y then divided by this value is not put in the st standard forms. But in this case here divided by dy you get the standard forms. It implies y into dx upon dy is equal to x plus 2y square. Suppose here divided by y it implies dx upon dy plus or is equal to x by y plus 2 times y. Or write dx upon dy minus 1 by y plus you can write minus 1 by y into x is equal to 2y which is in the form of dx and dx upon dy plus p into x equal to q. Here p and q are either constant or function of x. Therefore, here what is the value of p minus 1 by y and q means 2y is clear. Then find the integrating factors. What is integrating factor in this case? Therefore, integrating factor is e to the power integral of p into dy. e to the power integral of what is the value of p? Minus 1 by y into dy. You know that e to the power minus 1 by y means log y to the base c. It means e to the power log of y to the power minus 1 means 1 by y to the base c its value is 1 by y. y to the power minus 1 means 1 by y. Then write the general solutions. Here the general solution is x into integrating factors. Here remember x into integrating factor is equal to integral log integrating factor into q into d1 plus integral constant x into 1 by y is equal to 1 by y into what is the value of q? q means 2y into dy plus integral constant. Its value is equal to x divided by y is equal to y, y cancels 2 constant 1 into dy plus integral constant. Therefore, this value is equal to x by y is equal to 2 into y plus integral constant. Or you can write x equal to 2y square plus c into y is the general solution of the given differential equations. Here put in the form of dx upon dy forms. Yeah, dy upon dx dx upon dy form easy Then you find the integrating factors here. Just remember integrating factor is e to the power integral of p into dy. Method is same. In this case, the general solution is x into integrating factors is equal to integral of integrating factor into q with respect to y accurate. And one more problem, so use this type of problems. Find the general solution of the differential equation. Suppose here the very simple problems x plus y into dy upon dx is equal to 1. Suppose the next one is find the general solution of the differential equations. Very simple problems x plus y into dy upon dx is equal to 1. Here rewrite these equations. The given differential equations x plus y into dy upon dx is equal to 1. Even now rewrite mod right? dy upon dx equal to 1 divided by x plus y. It is not a standard form. Even now rewrite mod contra. You just think dx upon dy is equal to x plus y. Then rewrite dx upon dy minus x is equal to y. Which is in the form of dx upon dy plus p into x is equal to q form. So, here p and minus 1 no, and q and y. p and q are either constant or function of x. Then finding the integrating factors. What is integrating factors? In this case, e to the power integral log p into dy minus 1 into dy. Its value is e to the power minus 1. Then write the general solutions. 
what is the general solution of the given differential equation andre x into e raised to minus y is equal to e to the power minus y into q means y into dy plus integral constant it means x into e raised to minus y is equal to here y into e to the power minus y into dy plus integral constant product of two functions using integrations by parts algebraic function is the first functions exponential function is second functions first functions what is integration of e raised to minus y e raised to minus y divided by minus 1 minus derivative of y with respect to y is 1 into e raised to minus y divided by minus 1 into dy plus integral constant. Therefore, x into e raised to minus y is equal to minus y into e raised to minus y minus minus plus integration of e raised to minus y with respect to y plus integral constant c2. Therefore, x into e raised to minus y is equal to minus y into e raised to minus y plus integration of e raised to minus y is e raised to minus y divided by minus y plus integral constant c or you divided by e raised to minus y maadithre minus y cancel agathe minus 1 plus c into e raised to y it is the general solution of the given differential equations this method is called linear differential equations methods it's clear thank you